In this quick tutorial, I'll show you how to properly connect a PlayStation 5 console to your Insignia Fire TV and set it up for the first time. So let's get your PS5 connected to your Insignia Smart TV. First, let's plug in the power cord and the HDMI cable into your PS5. Then we'll plug in the HDMI cable to your TV's one of the HDMI in ports. Go for HDMI ER port if it's available. Now we will connect our PS5 to power and let's turn on our PS5 by pressing on the power button on our console. Your TV may try to connect to your PS5 automatically, but if it doesn't, then from the home screen we'll go to input and then select the HDMI port that you have connected your PS5 to. And from here let's also go ahead and rename our input to PlayStation. Now you can switch to your PlayStation using voice command. So let's switch to our PS5. And now you need to connect your PlayStation 5 DualSense controller to your console using the USB cable. Then press the PS button and start the setup by choosing your language. Now we will connect to a Wi-Fi network. I forgot to tell you but after pressing the PS button, you can unplug the cable from your controller if you want. Now adjust the display area if needed. If you have a game disc, you can insert it now so it can get installed while you are setting up your PS5. I'll go ahead and pop one in. Make sure that the side with the label is facing left. Now select your power option and accept the software license agreement. Now you need to sign in using your PSN account. If you don't have an account, you can create it right from here. So we'll go ahead and sign in. Now choose whether you want to create a login password or PIN. We will skip this and press OK. If you have another console such as a PlayStation 4, then you can also transfer its data by selecting transfer data. And just like that, we have successfully set up our PlayStation 5. And that's all there is to it. Now you're ready to start gaming on your PS5. Let us know your feedback and I'll see you in the next one.